for the Beaver Radio Network. I'm Brian Schultz, BSU women's basketball team. Won their last game before break. Joined right now by uh, Hannah Zarr, a sophomore out of Shakopee. Congratulations on the win. Thanks for joining us. Yeah, thank you for having me. Before the uh, Crookston win, you guys had lost five straight, all in the league. One of those five was against Crookston by 13 points. What happened in the game that you won that didn't happen in the game you lost? Uh, I think we just got off to a really good start. We talked about the day before that um, we need to be more encouraging. Um, we talk about just encouraging everybody else rather than if you're doing bad, do something good for someone else. So I think when we got up so fast that we kind of just realized, like, oh, my gosh, we can really do this. And then they started to make a comeback, but we kind of held on the rest of the game. Sierra Sensky uh, had 20 points in that win. How much better is she getting night in and night out? Uh, I think she takes good strides every night. I mean, people are starting to figure out what everybody's doing, and it's just we counter it every week, and we know that she's going to score 20-plus points a game. We need her to score 20-plus points a game, so we kind of just have to every week get better and figure out new ways for everybody to score as long as her, or as well as her, sorry. Team had 15 second chance points. That's hard to do in this league. Uh, this league is big, uh, long inside. How do you go about uh, making that a, a, a consistent thing? Uh, I think we just need to keep getting better on the boards. I mean, usually when we lose, um, they usually have double the rebounds we have. So, I mean, it was kind of nice that we kind of held off on the boards. But, I mean, we just need to get better at rebounding in general. Of all of your stats, points, shooting percentage, turnovers, everything, what stat are you most happy about? Uh, last game I had more rebounds than anything. I mean, I need. I think I just need to play better in general. I've had a few slumps, so, I mean – everything I don't know <laughs> I don't really I'm not really big into like scoring wise and my mom has the assist record here so I kind of want to beat that but it's hard to do that when shots don't fall so anything I'm happy with everything right now I mean as long as we got the win that's pretty much all that matters is there one area of the game that you definitely want to work on here in the second half uh I think I need to draw more fouls as like get to the free throw line more um I know I can score so I mean I just need to prove that I can make the basket and get a free throw with it uh, has it been off now for just over a week? How quickly do you, you do you lose basketball shape? And uh, what sorts of things do you do over break to, to try to keep it? Oh, you lose it fast. Uh, I weighed myself before I left and when I got home and I had already lost seven pounds by the end of break just from lifting wise because we lift so much harder here than what I can do at home. But um, you just need to keep running. You can't just go in and shoot. You have to play actual games. Uh, you realize when you get back to practice that it's no matter how hard you play at home, you're not going to be as in shape as you are here because – you know, this is a different league than playing high school girls. So, uh, What sorts of games are you expecting on a Minot and Mary this week? Uh, last year they were both hard. We went in a double overtime with uh, you, Mary. So hopefully we figure things out. I know they've lost people, we've lost people, but they've also gained new talent too. So I think we just need to come out and have a good week of practice. No school, so I mean that'll help too. Just focus on basketball and hopefully get two Ws this weekend. Best of luck. Thank you.